Lees spent his life in the sun. I would have had oh, well over 100 skin cancers cut off in that time, probably closer to 200. Four of those were melanomas, the most dangerous skin cancer. Never wore a hat, never wore sunscreen, and this is the result. Lee's undergone nearly every treatment possible, but remains optimistic. That one there, that is um, a melanoma that they removed. I've had radiation in every area of my head, and the doctors have said there is no more. My wife worries all the time about my melanomas that pop up and things like that, but I have a different philosophy. Treating melanomas often involves invasive procedures like surgery or radiation therapy. But new research from Charles Darwin University and RMIT offers a glimmer of hope. They found that a specific extract from the cannabis sativa plant has a deadly effect on melanoma cells. Uh, we're talking about a malignant melanoma, which is a, a fatal condition of skin cancer. It's a discovery that could change the way melanomas are treated. It works by uh, forcing the cell to go to what we call it a programmed cell death or apoptosis. And that's uh, for us as a, a, an initial studies done uh, in a lab condition, it's a great result. The effects of cannabis will still need to be tested on animals and then it'll go to human trials. But for people like Lee, other options to surgery are welcome. If I didn't have to have things cut out of me, I wish I'd known about this 10 years ago. Surviving, but running out of options. Lee hopes a new treatment isn't too far away. Roxanne Fitzgerald, ABC News.